Text Field Delegate. In this section, we are going to see the UI text field and its delegate methods and how those delegates are implemented. In this example, open the Interface Builder file. Let's drag and place a label to the basic UI view. Place another label and change its text to Name. Now let's drag and drop a text field. Finally, we can add a button and make its title as Submit. We can also clear the text of the first label added. Now open the interface file and create outlets for a label, text field, and button. Let's also declare a method to implement as the button action. Now we can open the implementation file. Here we can write the implementation for the button action. In the button action, let's change the label text to Hello, followed by text field content, and make the keyboard disappear. We have to now connect the UI elements we have added in the interface builder to the outlets we have declared. We can do this by right-clicking on each item and connect its outlet link to the corresponding IB outlet. For the button, we have to connect the IB action also to the method we have created. Let's build and run the project to see the result. Just type something in the text field and click the Submit button. As we can see, the label text gets changed to Hello, followed by the text in the text field. Now we can see how to implement the same result without using button. We are going to use the text field delegate instead of button to do this. Let's start by removing the button from the view of the interface builder. Also, remove the button outlet and button action from the interface file. Now let's go ahead and implement the delegate method for the text field. For this, first add the UI text field delegate class in the extend section of the interface file. Next, we can implement the text field should return method. The parameter given to this method is the text field object, which triggers this method. The return type is Boolean. This method will be called when we click the return button of the keyboard, which appears while touching the text field. Let's implement the code to change the label text and resigning the keyboard in this method. Now we can remove the button action implementation method from the implementation file. Next step is to link the delegate of the text field added in the interface builder to the file's owner. Now build and run the application. We can see that after typing something in the text field and pressing the return button in the keyboard, the text of the label is changed to hello, followed by the content of the text field. Also, the keyboard is resigned.